Alrighty, everyone, welcome back to some more Mario vs. Donkey Kong. We're gonna start today off at World 1 slash 5. Jump in, see what we got. So far, as I've said in earlier episodes, if, you know, if someone's new just watching this first time, Here we go. it's a lot more relaxed game. Controls are not my cup of tea, but. But they're not horrible. Hmm. All right, so we got the Got the box. All right, now we're getting into the time stuff. All right, gotcha. So I've got to have this switch pushed. We get the key out. Oh, okay. I got you. Y'all watch this. Whoop, that ain't gonna work. That will. And there we go. <clears throat> not too bad, not too bad. Like I said, starting to get a little bit, just a hair bit more challenging. Like right, jumping through, it's, we're still in the, still in the arm um, tutorial, so. Let's go ahead and get that. All right, it looks like I can actually get rid of the hammer now, which is nice. Got all the presents, got the toy, <clears throat> all gravy, baby. We might actually just start doing three, maybe even four per episode. Now that I've pretty much figured out how to do this. But of course, that's going to always depend on the boards. So let's, whoops, I hit the wrong button. Let's go into world one six and see what we got. The boards start getting to where I'm having to think through them a whole lot. It could be down to just one per day, but... So far, it's looking like not going to be that bad. Oh, yeah. All right, so we got a handstand jump. So you get like that, and there you go. All right, that's pretty cool. That'd have been information nice to know a while ago. And stand double jump. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, that'd have been information nice to know at the beginning. That looks like an angry pile of rocks. All right, got the first boards, whatever box. All 
Oh, duh. It just showed me what I have to do. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. So, apparently, I can fend off stuff. Now, I've got to get down here. That's, that's a pretty neat little metric. Alright, cool beans. We got it. We got the present. Let's go on through the door. So yeah, that's a neat metric. Doing a handstand. And, you know, feet up in the air protects you so you don't get hit in the head. That's pretty cool. I just don't have to remember it. Although that one bounced off my head, which don't make any sense. Backflip. So, oh, okay. Cool. So yes, you can throw the hammer now. That's all right, we've got all three presents, so you just pick it up. Cool beans. So the same um button you push to pick the hammer up, you can use to throw the hammer to get it out your hand. The first few boards it didn't let you, I'm guessing you know maybe just I, who knows. Whatever game. But yeah, that was pretty neat. I enjoyed that board pretty much. All right, well, those look like they're going to start getting into difficult boards, I'm guessing. So we beat one through six and hundred percent of it. Wait a minute. Why has this got a one up on it? We're going to go back real quick and check that out. See what that's all about. So this would be world one dash two, but the icon changed and that's why. All right, so it's a one-up board. Gotcha. Wow, we barely got that, but whatever. Three, four, five. Five one ups if you get the box, and there was three on the ground. So we're gonna have to keep our eyes open for those. So all in all, that was a pretty good day. I'm starting to enjoy this a little bit more, getting a little bit, you know, controls are getting a little bit more fluid with me, and there's more actions to do, so it's a little bit more lively. So hopefully y'all are enjoying it as much as I am, and I hope to see y'all the next time. let me in. No. Be gone with him. Come on, boys. What in the hell was that all about? Get off my 